A big special thanks to Walter Stevens for recording all the footage of these Buzz episodes and for blessing my server with the D-Troller. So this is Hollywood Quiz. This is all about Hollywood and the people in it. Oh. Hollywood. The streets are paved with gold. Hello! Please put your hands together for everyone's favorite host, Buzz! Hello, Cleveland! As far back as I can remember, I always... Oh, this is a Hollywood star now, huh? And here I am! Please show your appreciation of my lovely assistant, Rose! And let's meet our contestants! Today we have... Beesnam, me, Seth, and Jackson. Hello. Let's make it happen! After this loaded screen. Yes. As always. The first round of this fabulous thing I'm shall be Hollywood stars. That means it's going to be stars. mostly about actors and actresses from right. possibly the Hollywood, uh, not Hollywood sign, but you know, like the line. Right. That Life may be like say. a box of chocolates, but in Hollywood stars, you choose what you're going to get. Take it in turns to watch the selection wheel and buzz in when it stops on a topic you like. Then everyone answers questions on your selection with the color buttons. Simple, but brilliant. Just like Buzz. Yep. Alright, so d gets first selection. Press the red button on the subject you want. Frat pack! Yeah, I feel the need! The need for Triv! The 2006 comedy rock band Tenacious D were in... What? Oh my god, yes, I know this one! Did anyone get it right? Doomed. Oh. Actually, you know the pick of Destiny? I know a little bit of it, but I don't know much of it. I know it's one of Jack Black's movies, but... Oh, um, I'm going to say... Oh, wait a minute, I know. Uh. Uh -huh. Wait, wait, Jack Black did the King Kong? Yeah. Yeah, Jack Black was in Tom was in King Kong. I have no idea. Oh, my turn. Uh, shoot. More you know. Um. Special effects. Special effects. Will you find one? Some sugar, baby. Which special effect brings this family favorite to life? Ooh. Um. Super Mario Nation? Is that like a YouTube channel or something? That's the answer. Animatronic. Yeah, I knew it was animatronic. Oh Jack, my god. Super Mario Nation? I just thought that would be, oh that would be like a crazy question. <laughs> Not a crazy question, a crazy answer. Alright, the T1000. Uh, that's easy. Oh, that's easy. You got to know this. I we really up that because I want everybody to got that one. Okay. All right, step your turn. Hit the red Jesus button when it lands on the category you want. I'll eat your face. Look at the size of my mouth. I mean it. Aiden, come on. There's some weird things from Buzz. Leonardo DiCaprio. Let's play. Well, I know a little bit about him. Being a little Which bit. movie does Leonardo That's DiCaprio play Robert De Niro's stepson? To I'll buy see. Oh. I'm going to say. Oh, me. Say that. Oh. See. Player two. A hat trick. I just guess. Go. This boy's like. The wrong answer in France. The wrong answer. In which movie do Leonardo DiCaprio and Virginie Ledoyen run headlong off the top of a waterfall? Uh. I've seen the Romeo and Juliet with Leonardo DiCaprio, and I don't remember them going. Let's go! I feel right. Get the questions right. All right, Jackson, your pick. When the selection okay. lands on the subject you want, hit the red button. Ooh, I... where the questions die. Got away. 
Friend or foe? Alright! Either gonna be that or Prime. But. In the oh, this one right, goes my way. First befriended, then harassed by Jim Gary. 128. 128 by 128. Let's find out if anyone takes the points. Okay. Matthew Frederick. I haven't seen Everybody has a thousand now. But I have heard about it. Who plays both King Louis and King Philippe in the 1998 adaptation of The Man in the Iron Mask? Uh-oh. Um, I'm going to say this person. Last points Leon, are, are you kidding me? The category I literally stomped on. Leonardo DiCaprio has been in so many films. At the end of round we're all time for, we're all time for second. Mr. Always Wins is in the lead yet again, and everyone else is tied for second. Mm-hmm. Alright, what's the next game? This one is called... If it would load... The oh, Fastest oh, Finger! Remember that one? Finger time. Like old Jack Burton always says, it's all in the reflexes. Be the fastest to answer the questions correctly and keep your answer speed high if you want to outscore your opponents. It's like the movie right. Speed. All right, gentlemen. Consequence. Let's do this. Oh, fair enough. It's like Speed without things exploding. Oh, got the guy, mate! Who's playing the oh, Speed the movie. Action okay. Era. The father in love oh. and actor. Ah, oh, crap. Let's see if anyone can I'm just making a random guess. Let's go! Mike Myers. Step and only. Why not recognize the photo? That's Mike Myers. It did not look like Mike Myers. Apparently, it's Mike Myers. Does not appear in this 1960s classic. Um. I just guess. Okay. Which Canadian songstress was this heartthrob engaged to between 2004 and 2006? Oh boy. Oh. I'm going to say. Hey, oh. Nobody got that. Oh, I was gonna make a scary boy joke. Who's behaving badly? Oh, uh, I'm going to say there's two Johns, so I'm just gonna take a guess from one. Nope. Hey, I was not. I was right for the first John. Yeah. <laughs> Interesting approach to a game called Fast as Finger. Wait hours to answer. Ah, oh, shush. <laughs> <laughs> Player three, this one to stay up there. Dang it! Finally, d gets one right! What's this man's occupation in Clint Eastwood's Oscar-winning Western? Unforgive him. Um... There we go. Here. <laughs> Player one, you made us wait how long for that? This act yeah, 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 I saw Dingler in which watery adventure comedy? Um, Buzz is a simple game. I thought you'd be up to it. Who no, the freak? Who that film? I'm unimpressed. In which 1974 disaster movie does this Hollywood legend play Fire Chief Michael O'Hallorahan? I'm going to say this one. Uh, that one. 
Fire and Inferno. I mean, it says fire, and Candle it might also sky. gotta be Inferno or something. And with those points mm -hmm. comes the end. Yeah, I didn't think about it like that. Aw, <laughs> man. Oh. Bad ends fast as finger. Let's see how everybody came out of that. Player two in the lead and player four in the loser's seat. Time to move on. Oh Superman with super speed in the lead, and I th and player four is hanging in the back for a peanut butter banana sandwich. Snack time. Next round is fact or fiction. Food was convincing the world he didn't exist. Let's see if I can trick you again. It's fact or fiction. Okay, we all know that Buzz and the Truth are not the best of bedfellows. And here's your chance to play Sherlock. Buzz is going to read out some statements. Some might be true. Some might be pulled out from somewhere there's no sun. Use the blue and orange buttons to tell me if you think he's talking fact or fiction. Blue for true, orange for false. A right answer gives you points, a wrong answer loses points. Only two members of the principal cast of Greece were actually still in their teens. Fact or fiction? That feels like a fact. That feels like a fact. Okay, that was a fact. Oh, no, I just look like an idiot. Let's see what. Let's see the explanation. They were both 19 years old. They were both 19. Was 24. Kaniki was 28. Sandy was 29. And Rizzo was 34. Rizzo was 34. Yup. Yeah. Here's the next statement. No, you're in Grenadian! was singing with Tony the Tiger in a Frosty's commercial. Fact or fiction? Yeah, okay. The first ever acting job was to sing with Tony the Tiger in a commercial for Frosted Flakes. All right. It's got, it's a, it's a no! It's fiction! It's fiction! We all fell for that, Porky. Oh, I know the Frosty commercial! I'm pulling your leg. Her first ever acting job was actually. She was actually singing with the Honey Monster. I seriously, ask her once. So we all lost points for that one. And that's why nobody watches TV to watch the commercial. She makes a cameo appearance in Star Wars Episode One: The Phantom Menace. Fact. Did they hear that right? The eighteen. Did E.T. make a oh, cameo e. in Star Wars Phantom Menace? No, I don't think he was in the Phantom Menace. Oh, Apparently he was. He was. I'm catching up, Ben Page. The longest screen kiss featured in a 1941 movie and was a breathtaking three minutes and five seconds long. Eh, fact! I don't think it's the that one, I guess! I don't think it's 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 that one, I guess! Ah, the joy of Ooh. leading player one. Like three minutes. That's it. I'm factored out. It's a long so time. Before I drop any more <laughs> huge porkies, let's see how your lie detection affected the positions. I'm in last. Right now. Let's see. Got by one. Right now, player four. You're like a boil on There's the a wide bar. separation between the top two and the bottom two, but within each camp, everything's really close.
This is top rank. You remember top rank, right? Oh, basically, you put in the right order, and then you'll be able to win. Ooh, there goes Buzz. This time, you need to use all four color buttons to put the answers in the right order. The faster you do it, the more points you'll score. Savvy? Alright, so, unlike the old top rank, this one, it does matter how fast you do it, because you get more points if you get it right faster. Arrange these words to form the title of a 2007 part animated, part live action movie. Oh. Oh, this should be fun. Uh, okay. Uh, mm. Mm. Arthur and the Invisibles. Everybody knew that one. I remember that movie. I don't know why I've actually seen that movie. Alright. Rearrange these words to form the title of a Ben Stiller rib tickler. Mm. There's something about Mary. Never heard about that movie. Total guess, player two. I'm not stupid. <laughs> Oh, Put these movies in chronological order of the era in which they are set. Of the era. Oh goodness! Yes, I'm going oh, to try, say. Try, 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 try. Uh, let's see. Um, that, and then. Uh... I don't know. They're probably gonna pull my hammer with the other two, right? Teaming up. Oh, it's the other two. Dang it. Strategy and ah. this. Well. Unless you find yourself tied to a okay. moron. Okay, let's hope I got it right. Yes. Rearrange these words to form the title of an Australian oddity. Mm. Oh, okay, I think I got it a little bit mixed up. Okay, I got mine in. The Adventures of Priscilla, Queen oh, of the Desert. Right. Yep, I had a feeling of that one. I was the only one that got it. The Adventures of Queen Priscilla of the Desert? Was that what y'all were trying to type? Yes. Mm. Rearrange these words to form a line. Wow, I'll, I'll get that one right. Six cents. Right. To form a line from six cents, okay. Six cents! I think we all know this one. I see dead people. And apparently I'm not the only one seeing dead people. Well answered. And the last points of that eventful round. Player one, top ranks all about breaking top and how the tables have turned. <laughs> Clint Eastwood takes the lead, Superhero Nell was tied for second, and Rambo Rambo's on. Oh no, it's pie fights. <laughs> and only but a goodie thanks to the three students. The second rule of pie fight is Okay, so let me see. So, since Decent has the most points, oh god, so he did! Oh, no. oh, that's only in five player mode. Pie fight's not the hey, finale listen. here. The quickest correct answer arms you with a pie. Throw oh some my god, why? In here, depending on how many. In, in here, depending on how long you last, that's how many points you get. Like, whoever goes the longest with that, whoever, whoever remains gets a thousand points. Second place gets 500, third gets 250, fourth gets nothing. It's like, seriously, Bugs, why do you get a bike while well, Rock Roads? Alright. Alright, Jackson gets the first pie. We all have two lives, so this should be a fun and easy so game. You no. hide yourself! <laughs> With a pie in your face, you speak only in bows. Last life, player four. Player four, you're you're pain, next. and you're right. Last chance. Last words, Next question. Humphrey Bogart should never have switched from Scotch to what? Yeah. Nobody got that right. Next question. 
Richard Burton stars as the brutal O'Brien in which depressing vision of the future. Of course you know 1984, Mr. Apple. Mm -hmm. Don't! You just, and you just pardoned yourself. I hope it was Apple. <laughs> yes! Why are you hitting your dog? Why are you hitting your dog? Why are you hitting your dog? <laughs> I want to purse. Uh, uh, I'm going to say that one. Chicago. By some miracle, you got it. And who's for the pie? Bye bye. One one five percent. Nice. Oh, he's not out yet. He still has one life. Right. Everyone except which midnight cowboy? The wild card has one life. Jody's father. Okay, so what do you mean? I'm going to say. You got it! One of these right. Stab got it first. Alright, hit the red button to throw a pie, but try not to buy yourself. Mm. Player two. Bye bye. Oh, come on! <laughs> Player two. No points for you. And frankly, my dear, okay, so it's 300 for. See, how much is it for third it's place? Two, it's 250 for third, 500 for second, and 1000 for first. Okay. He gets chased all over town, riding one of these. Oh, come on! We okay. all knew that Please. one, surprisingly. Please be Try not friend. to buy yourself. Please be a friend. Please be a friend. Please be a friend. Go! No! Yes! Ouch! <laughs> A member of the pie fight has a name. Fucking bitch. Name was player one. 250 points for him. Oh, which means it's down to the remaining two for first place points. Oh no, but even if I... This comic actor. Okay. Um, that is... Um, 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 oh! Oh! I knew that one! I, I didn't see the button. <laughs> I can say, wasn't he the person that was going to voice track? Or am I thinking of someone else? Yeah, yeah he, yeah, he was oh. going to voice track before he died. Yes! Uh, Alright, down to one more pie to decide it all. This is the difference between 500 points and a thousand. Who did Jim Carrey and Taya Leone have fun with? I knew that one! Okay. What? Let's, let's see, fate, be a good friend. Be a good friend. Be a good friend. No, 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 I didn't press it. I didn't press it. Do it. Incoming. No. With a face full of custard and 500 points. Meaning I left, we mean, meaning I, last one standing, gets the full thousand. Full 1k. In first place. Let's see how that affects the scores. Duke 86. Oh. The only. Rambo, Rambo's on. Elvis is dancing in third. Superhero Last one. Number one. Clint Eastwood with a quick shot. Stays number one. Rollover. Smell that. I love the smell of rollover in the morning. Or indeed, at any time. Hit me! Right, use your buzzer to select something you want to answer questions about, then hope that those questions come up on your turn. Right answers means you're rolling in points. Wrongies means the points roll over to whoever's next. Got it? Got it. So, I, so you get a question all to yourself. If it's right, if you get it right, it's 250. You get it wrong, the next player's worth 500 and so on. Oh, before I forget, how long does a, does a recording of Wildcard and Friends usually last? Because I have an exercise question. It's usually, two to three. it's usually at least two hours, sometimes three. Uh, Seth, okay. pick a category that you hope to see in your selection. Player four. Family. Show us what it means to be decisive. Now, well, Jackson, you get to pick a category and hope it shows up on your list. <sighs> Player two. Opening Choose, lines. Please. Elizabeth Taylor, I hit that by accident. Your selection, please. Alfred Hitchcock. So those are the categories of the questions that will be randomly selected. 
the first turn will go to Greg Jackson. That means the first question's all to yourself. Get it right, we're 250. Okay, four. From the top for 250 points. Opening mm -hmm. line. Which animated movie begins with a small boy playing by himself and saying, All right, everyone, this is a stick up. Oh, this one's easy. You have answered Sorry, correctly. Sorry. That's 250 for you. Okay. That means the next question will be worth 250. And who gets that one? D Sim. Okay, player one for the basic 250 points. Which scary movie features this horrific house? Bullseye. Correct. It's 250 for you. My turn. Player two from the beginning. This for 250 points. Elizabeth Taylor has been married eight times. Which husband did she marry twice? Um, D. It says crap. So the points roll over. That means step house question is now worth five hundred points. This oh, I'm going to sound not very good in this question. But isn't Richard Burton? The part double. In which well yeah, if you get it wrong, it's double for the next player. Go on, boy! That's how this is your question. Be sure to buy. Be sure to get merch. No! Railway children. Wait a minute! That means Jackson's question is now worth 750 points. Right for 750 rolled over points. Who says, whenever I get gloomy with the state of the world, I think about the arrivals gate at Heathrow Airport. Okay, okay, okay. Faith, please be good, please be good, please be good. Blue. It takes skill and That's skill my second guess. That is that. Roll them over! <sighs> This one, player one, for a thoroughly serious 1,000 points! I did not see this coming. Which Hitchcock movie features James Stewart in a wheelchair? For a thousand. No! no. 1250 if I get this right. Standing between you and Ooh, if you, if you get this right, you'll be able to sell these and score in sense. What is the name mm -hmm. of Elizabeth Taylor's winning horse in the classic National Velvet? Um, Beauty? Because Silver is Lone Ranger, right? Bye bye. The pie! <laughs> <laughs> How ironic! All right, Setel, for well, 1,500 points. A lot, right? Player three. Okay, don't let me down. That guy is making me horny. In the movie oh. Chicken Run, Rocky Rhodes convinces the oh, Chicken Run that he can. It's been about eat. 30 years since the movie came out. Wait, why? Yes, he did. Let's go, finally. That's the major point for you. Let's go, 4300, baby. Let's see where that puts everybody. And I'm still on that place. You're still in last place, but you're really close to everybody. Did Jason, did you pick full game or point game? Uh, Full game. Okay, I guess we're still going then. Yeah, since Kenny wanted, you know, that... Thing. Right. Let's see if we let's see what we got. Point thing. Thomas Crown. Ooh, you can steal Robin people's Hood, points. Buster Edwards. Come yes. Join the ranks of the greatest thieves ever committed to Buster I think it sounds self-explanatory. Your coins are getting stealed. Alright, no, it's not stolen. If you're right, you get to pinch you? someone's points. You've got to pick a pocket or two. Alright, this one's a bit different. You hit the red button as soon as you think you know what the picture is. Then select the choice with the colored button. Okay. 
the buzzer as it's actually supposed to be used. Yes, so you, so the big red button to buzz in, then you pick an answer. But you have to buzz in first. In which movie would we see this message? Jackson, select an answer. Jew brother, the un unfinished. You are yeah, correct. What you say. Yes, hey. All right. All right. Now the stealing part. Press the button above the player you want to steal points from. Yeah, I think it's him. I just want to say thank you I'm for so uh, fresh really, suck my really nuts. Cool <laughs> yeah. Did I mention okay, so. Perky? <laughs> If I don't get a question right now, someone's job's on the line. Who's looking pleased with himself? Uh, that dial, who is that? Yes, Christopher Lloyd. Lloyd from Back to the Future. Right. Player one doesn't want the Whose pocket's Five. getting picked? Player three. Player three. Good Fuck! Top oh no. Oh, point, baby. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Who lives here? Okay, buzz in when you know what it is. Come on, it's um, nice and easy. Uh, Can you see him? Help me. No! Don't. Oh. Also wrong. Is that? Okay, I'm going to say. Step and buzz in first. Let's go! Crazy. Crazy. What that Thunderbird? Help me, Thunderbird. To each according to their need. Give no, I thought we were friends. <laughs> Sorry, bud. Points. Next question, please. Here's the next question. Who's planning his next move? Hmm. Um. Um. Uh, mm. Oh. Uh. Okay. Step. He got it. Morgan Freeman. Freeman. Player four, you're careless with your lead. Well, it was the glove that he do. He fucked up. All right. Oh, why? Robin, let me go with no lag. Bye bye. <laughs> Come on. There's still more. Like this, he's Morgan Freeman. Fun fact, Morgan Freeman's big bad. I don't know these people. Jackson. Okay, I'm going to say... Uh, give me a second. Okay, so I think it's... Ooh, I think it's this one. It yes. is. Okay. Uh, Whose pocket's getting picked? That elusive fourth. Player four, come on. Whose points? Player Thank one. you, Decent Board. Let's see. Give me all these points. <laughs> see, really means the Suck my nuts. Of course, this is a thing. Time to bring the round to a close. Last question. Final question. Which Pink Panther character is this? Oh uh, crap! I don't know anything. Nope. Four twenty-five. Four twenty-five point six. Okay. Uh, and uh, that okay, is suggestive. I'm going to. I'm going to <laughs> it is suggestive. Buzz it if you know it. No. It was Kato. At Kato? Well, that's it. No answers. Well, that's the end of point, Steve. What the buzz in? Let's see the season of the Jettles body. The tides have turned. Let's go back in the lead. Baby, finally! Rambo, Rambo's out in front. man? Oh, man. We're in the end game. It's the final countdown. Final. Okay. Alright. Listen, think of your Time passes, but stop when you answer. Wrong answers are the kiss of death. 
When you're out okay. of bars, you're out of the round. And that right. is that. Your points become time. Answer fast and quick to get more time. If you're wrong, you lose time. Run out of time, you're out. Last one standing wins. Points. What you want is time. And the more you've scored, the more seconds you win. Make sure you answer quickly as time is constantly dropping. Let's see how much time we got. Oh boy. Oh no. <laughs> Answer the question. Unusual about Spider-Man and Mary Jane's first kiss. You look garden. That was easy. Yeah. We all got it right, but I got it fast, so I get bonus time. That smell, my friend, is the smell of last place. In Minority Report, I, for I forgot you don't have to use the buzzer. Police department with information yeah. about future crimes. What the hell? For first place, player four. I hit the wrong thing, probably. Yep. And that didn't matter. Did. That's that a time penalty. That didn't matter anyway. Okay. I'm taxing your time. Keep yeah, speeding the clock up. up. <laughs> Which singer turned actress hey, stars as a single mother looking for love in the 1990 drama Mermaids? Um. No, I picked the wrong one. <laughs> Nobody got that one. It's Madonna. Not two stinkers in a row. Get a grip. Hold up. In the Caribbean, what is the Black Pearl? <sighs> the Black Pearl. That takes a time penalty and Jackson gets a bonus. Does, player three. Hey. That's three wrongins in a row. Shut up, Hope! Oh, you are totally running out of time! Sean Connery adventure, what um, is The Rock? Rock. It can't be a wrestler, that'd be too obvious. It's a prison. I was guessing like a criminal mess. I'm coming in the lead! Come on! Who said, one morning I shot an elephant in my pajamas? How he got into my pajamas, I'll never know. Ah, oh, crap. Uh, 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 uh. Kick, talk, you're about to listen to me. If I get this wrong, I'm out. Damn it! Ooh. Oh, well, that was Woody Allen. Oh, my God. Bye-bye. Oh. Oh. <laughs> you want to get nuts? Come on, let's get nuts. More speed. Speed up. Yeah. Whose voice features in both Mulan and Shrek? Oh, everyone dropped. Yeah, I knew that one too, and I'm not even in it. Hello, Mark. It's falling apart for you, Player Three. You were in first place just now. Oh my God, shut up! Which actress is best known for her role as aspiring dancer Alex Owens in Flashdance? I've never seen Flashdance. <laughs> Come on, you can get Captain. This is danger. Let's oh, oh, finish third. Oh. The real rain has come. Okay, I Holy crap! It's a death match between us. Here we go! If I can win this, then I will feel really happy about this. No! Um, okay! Is it time? Is it time? Elimination! Ta ta! Wait, oh, this is <laughs> Oh god. So whoever leads after this next one, you're our winner. Go! They would just die. Oh, you got Sun Death question now. By Donald Sutherland in the it's not in Gog! Oh. Sudden Gog! He was the first right oh, yes. answer. That's the winner, Jackson! Oh god. 
I would like to thank the Academy, <laughs> and I would like to thank <laughs> my pet, Pet Cat Lucy. Uh, that cat okay? Just don't worry. Oh, it's All right. It's over. We it's have over. A champion. You know, uh, it's all right, it I can. I have high grounds. Dexterity, hands, and of course, a whole lot of. I think we should end this with Disney's thing first. Sounds like a good idea. Sounds like a good idea. Um, is anyone in favor of ending it with Disney's thing first? I think it'll be a good idea. Alright, we'll, we'll do that after. Yeah. I think so. Oh, okay, I got the same one. And got the good old words. Comic relief in this blockbuster. Hey, and, of and of course, I get the crap medals. <laughs> Still got the medals regardless. That's good. Let's see what prize Jackson wins for beating this game. Bruh. I win a new car. Oh. My own chocolate factory. Ooh, a little Oompa Loompas. I'll name them all Jerry. Ooh. <laughs> that is cute, I think. Yeah. All right, so just think fast is the last one then? Yeah, if you guys are up for it. I'm up for it. Alright, let's do some let's finish with some Disney.